Abigail Norton Bush became the center of controversy when she presided over the nation's second women's rights convention held in Rochester in August 1848, making her the first woman in the U.S. to lead a public meeting of both men and women. A man had presided over the first convention in Seneca Falls two weeks earlier, and many feared that a woman chair would distract from the meeting's purpose. From that point forward, women were always chosen president of women's rights conventions in the United States.